Hello. Allô 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 euh, Oui, j'ai activé le son, là, mais personne ne me répond.
Chín cho khỏi trầm thơm mây kết thành mấy năm sắc dâng lên khắp mười phương cung dường vô lượng bục vô lượng chư bồ tát cùng các thanh hiền tăng nơi phàm giới dung thông kết đài sen rực rỡ nguyện làm kẻ đông hân trên con đường giác ngộ xin mọi loài chúng sanh từ bỏ cõi làng quên theo đường giới định tuệ quay về trong tình thức để từ chúng con à, kính dân hương lên bục và chư vị bồ à, tát In gratitude we offer this incense Throughout space and time To all Buddhas and Bodhisattvas May it be fragrant as a and the one who is bowed to
Offering light in the ten directions. The Buddha. Teaching and living the way of awareness in the very midst of suffering and confusion. Shakyamuni Buddha, the fully enlightened one, to whom we bow in gratitude. Cutting through ignorance, awakening our hearts and our minds. Manjushri, the Bodhisattva of great understanding, to whom we bow in gratitude. Working mindfully, working joyfully for the sake of all beings. Sankara, the Bodhisattva of great action, to whom we bow in gratitude. Listening deeply, serving beings in countless ways. Avalokiteshvara, the Bodhisattva of great compassion, to whom we bow in gratitude.
Fearless and persevering through realms of suffering and darkness. Shiji Gaba, the Bodhisattva of great aspiration, to whom we bow in gratitude. and all beings, nourishing, holding, and healing all. Bodhisattva Gaya, Great Mother, Precious Jewel of the Cosmos, to whom we bow in gratitude. Showing the way fearlessly and compassionately, the stream of all our ancestral teachers, to whom we bow in gratitude.
Đại chúng đã tập hợp đầy đủ chưa? Has the whole community assembled? Thưa đại chúng đã tập hợp đầy đủ. The whole community has assembled. Có sự hòa hợp không? Is there harmony in the community? Thưa, có sự hòa hợp. Yes, there's harmony. Đại chúng tập hợp hôm nay để làm gì? What is the reason for the community assembling today? Thưa, đại chúng tập hợp hôm nay để hồ niệm cho lễ xuất gia và thực hiện yết ma truyền giới sa di và sa di nữ. The community has assembled to give spiritual support for the ordination ceremony and to realize the Sangha Carmen for transmitting the novice precepts. Xin các vị tôn đức khắc sĩ nam và nữ lắng nghe. Các vị giới tử với pháp danh sau đây. Rosa Maria Martinez Santaella, Pure Emptiness of the Heart. Andrea Zanelli, Liberating Path of the Heart. Thomas Gerard Patrick Glennon, Peaceful Arrival of the Heart. Katrien van der Berger, Joyful Listening of the Heart. Aurélien Jacques Thierry Gérard Delot, Compréhension Naturelle du Coeur. Jie Wu, A Gentle Acceptance of the Heart. Julio Alejandro Armas España, Peaceful Home of the Heart. Ian Campbell Wiseman, Kind Awakening of the Heart. Mac Sichai, Smiling Moon of the Heart. Đang cầu xin được thọ giới sa di, sa di nữ và đã thỉnh được tôn đức pháp hiệu trước nhất sao hạnh làm hòa thượng truyền giới. Các vị giới tử nói trên đã trình bày là họ thanh tịnh không có gì chướng ngại. Nếu thấy thời gian thích hợp và không có gì trở ngại, xin các vị tôn đức chấp thuận cho các giới tự ấy tiếp nhận giới sa di 
Sa di nữ, đây là lời tác bạch. Bạch như thế thì phép tác bạch có rõ ràng và đầy đủ hay không? Rõ ràng và đầy đủ. Noble community of bhikshus and bhikshunis, please listen. The ordinees with the names already read are requesting to be ordained and to receive the novice precepts. The venerable master whose first name is Nyak and whose second name is Han has already accepted their invitation to be precept transmission master. The ordinees have shown that they are practicing the way of the precepts and that there is no impediment to their receiving the ordination. Venerable bhikshus and bhikshunis, if you see that this is the right time and there is nothing to obstruct the ordination, please allow these ordinees to be ordained and to receive the novice precepts. This is the proposal. Is the proposal clear and complete? Clear and complete. <clears throat> Xin các vị tôn đức khắc sĩ nam và nữ lắng nghe. Các vị giới tử với pháp danh đã đọc đang cầu xin được thọ giới sa di, sa di nữ và đã thỉnh được tôn đức pháp hiệu trước nhất sao hạnh làm hòa thượng truyền giới. Các vị giới tử nói trên đã trình bày là họ thanh tịnh, không có gì chướng ngại. Nếu thấy thời gian thích hợp và không có gì trở ngại thì xin các vị tôn đức chấp thuận cho các đối tượng ấy tiếp nhận giới sa di sa di nữ vị nào trong đại chúng chấp thuận thì xin giữ im lặng vị nào không chấp thuận thì nên nói lên noble community of big shoes and big shoes please listen the ordinaries with the dharma names already read are requesting to be ordained and to receive the novice precepts The venerable master whose first name is Nyak and whose second name is Han has already accepted their invitation to be precept transmission master. The ordinaries whose names have been read have shown that they are practicing the way of the precepts and that there is no impediment to their receiving the ordination. Venerable bhikshus and bhikshunis, if you see that this is the right time and there is nothing to obstruct the ordination, please allow these ordinaries to be ordained and to receive the novice precepts. Those of you who agree with the proposal should remain silent. Anyone who does not agree should speak out. Đây là lần hỏi thứ nhất. This is the first time of asking. Vị nào trong đại chúng chấp thuận thì xin giữ im lặng. Vị nào không chấp thuận thì xin nói lên. Those of you who agree with the proposal should remain silent. Anyone who does not agree should speak out. Đây là lần hỏi thứ hai. This is the second time of asking. Vị nào trong đại chúng chấp thuận thì xin giữ im lặng. Vị nào không chấp thuận thì nên nói lên. Those of you who agree with the proposal should remain silent. Anyone who does not agree should speak out. Đây là lần hỏi thứ ba. This is the third time of asking. Đại chúng, các vị tôn đức khắc sĩ nam và nữ đã giữ im lặng qua ba lần hỏi. Tôi biết toàn thể đã chấp nhận tác pháp yết ma truyền giới sa di, sa di nữ như vậy đã thành. Xin cảm tạ đại chúng. The venerable bhikshus and bhikshunis have remained silent for three times of asking and thus we know that you agree to the ordination and the sangha kaman for transmitting the novice precepts has been realized. Thank you.
Ordinees, please come forward with joined palms in front of the three jewels. On hearing the sound of the bell, after the recitation of each line, you will touch the earth one time. On hearing the sound of the bell, after the recitation of each line, please touch the earth one time. In gratitude to our father and mother who have brought us to life, we bow deeply before the three jewels in the ten directions. En gratitude envers notre père et notre mère, qui nous ont donné la vie, nous nous inclinons profondément devant les trois joyaux dans les dix directions. In gratitude to our teachers who have shown us how to understand and to love, we bow deeply before the three jewels in the ten directions. En gratitude envers notre maître et notre enseignant qui nous ont montré le chemin de la compréhension de l'amour, nous nous inclinons profondément devant les trois joyaux dans les dix directions. Yeah, the mang ơn sư trường giáo huấn cúi đầu kính lễ tam bảo thường trụ trong mười phương
in gratitude to our friends who give us guidance and support on the path. We bow deeply before the three jewels in the ten directions. En gratitude envers nos amis qui nous guident et qui nous soutiennent sur le chemin, nous nous inclinons profondément devant les trois joyaux dans les dix directions. Yoi tự mang ơn bằng hữu và các bậc thiện tri thức đã tác thành cho cúi đầu kính lễ tam bảo thường trụ trong mười phương in gratitude to all beings in the animal, plant, and mineral worlds. We bow deeply before the three jewels in the ten directions. En gratitude envers tous les êtres dans les royaumes des animaux, des plantes et des minéraux, nous nous inclinons profondément devant les trois joyaux dans les dix directions. Giới tự mang ơn mọi loài chúng sanh cây cỏ và đất đá. Cúi đầu kính lễ tam bảo thường trụ trong mười phương. Please kneel down with your palms joined. The whole community, please also join your palms in giving support to the ordinees as their hair is cut. Xin đại chúng chắp tay hồ niệm cho các nhớ tự trong giờ phục xuống tập. Holding the willow branch, sprinkling the nectar of compassion, destroying heat, cooling and refreshing the world of humans. By listening deeply and coming to help the being, and by teaching the Dharma, the Bodhisattva ends the suffering of all species. The Bodhisattva's love and compassion are unshakable. Her appearance manifests freedom and uprightness. She responds wherever there is a need. No appeal for her help fails to succeed.
nước này vốn sàng tam công đức tại đi trần cầu của muôn loài đưa vào cõi nhiệm màu hoa tàng chúng sanh mát mẻ không riêng ai nước không tẩy nước pháp thân nhiệm bùi không vương bùi từ tâm khai đang tràng rưỡi lên đã thân tình cây héo biên thần cây tốt tươi cõi về hoa ra làm cõi tình mọi loài mát mẻ sống yên vui đâu cần dương liêu vương cam lộ
Please repeat after me. Shedding my hair completely. Shedding my hair, my hair completely. I make the great vow today. I make the great vow today. To transform all my afflictions. To transform all my afflictions. And bring happiness to all beings. Shedding my hair completely. Shedding my hair completely. I make the great vow today. I make the great vow today. To transform all my afflictions. To transform all my afflictions. And bring happiness to all beings. And bring happiness to all beings. Shedding my hair completely. Shedding my hair completely. I make the great vow today. To transform all my afflictions. To transform all my afflictions. And to bring happiness to all beings. And to bring happiness to all beings. <laughs> Shedding my hair completely. Shedding my hair completely. I make the great vow today. I make the great vow today. To transform all my afflictions. To transform all my afflictions. And to bring happiness to all beings. And to bring happiness to all beings. Shedding my hair completely. Shedding my hair completely. I make the great vow today. I make the great vow today. To transform all my afflictions. To transform all my afflictions. And to bring happiness to all beings. And to bring happiness to all beings. Nam mô đấng bồ tát đà mi bi. transform all my afflictions to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings and to bring happiness to all beings shedding my hair completely shedding my hair completely i make the great vow today i make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings and to bring happiness to all beings Shedding my hair completely. Shedding my hair completely. I make the great vow today. I make the great vow today. 
to transform all my afflictions, to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings. And to bring happiness to all beings. Nam mô đăng bồ To transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings, shedding my hair completely, I make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings. Shedding my, Shedding my hair completely. I make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings. Cette chevelure. Me débarrassant complètement de cette chevelure. Je fais le grand vœu aujourd'hui. Je fais le grand vœu aujourd'hui. De transformer toutes mes afflictions. De transformer toutes mes afflictions. Et d'apporter le bonheur à tous les êtres. Et d'apporter le bonheur à tous les êtres. Me débarrassant complètement de cette chevelure. Me débarrassant complètement de cette chevelure. Je fais le grand vœu aujourd'hui. Je fais le grand vœu aujourd'hui. De transformer toutes mes afflictions. De transformer toutes mes afflictions. Et d'apporter le bonheur à tous les êtres. Et d'apporter le bonheur à tous les êtres. Me débarrassant complètement de cette chevelure. Me débarrassant complètement de cette chevelure. Je fais le grand vœu aujourd'hui. Je fais le grand vœu aujourd'hui. De transformer toutes mes afflictions. De transformer toutes mes afflictions. Et d'apporter le bonheur à tous les êtres. Et d'apporter le bonheur à tous les êtres. Nam mô To transform all my afflictions. Transform all my afflictions. And to bring happiness to all beings. To bring happiness to all living beings. Shedding my hair completely. Shedding my hair completely. I make the great vow today. 
make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings to bring happiness to all living beings shedding my hair completely shedding my hair completely i make the great vow today make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings to bring happiness to all beings nam mô đẳng today i make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings and to bring happiness to all beings shedding my hair completely shedding my hair completely i make the great vow today i make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings and to bring happiness to all beings shedding my hair completely shedding my hair completely i make the great vow today i make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings and to bring happiness to all beings nam mô đẳng bồ tát great vow today i make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings and to bring happiness to all beings shedding my hair completely shedding my hair completely i make the great vow today i make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings and to bring happiness to all beings shedding my hair completely shedding my hair completely i make the great vow today i make the great vow today to transform all my afflictions to transform all my afflictions and to bring happiness to all beings and to bring happiness to all beings nam mô đẳng bồ tát
断除烦恼，断除烦恼，解脱自在，解脱自在，剃清头发，剃清头发，我愿众生，我愿众生，断除烦恼，断除烦恼，解脱自在，解脱自在，剃清头发，剃清头发。我愿众生，我愿众生断除烦恼，断除烦恼，解脱自在，解脱自在。南无登阿婆。Ordinaries, this is the solemn moment when you will receive the ten novice precepts. Please listen carefully. The ten novice precepts are the door through which you enter the community of monks and nuns. They are the foundation for your receiving the pratimoksha in the future. You should listen to each precept as it is read with a mind which is clear and concentrated. Reply. Yes, I do. Whenever you see that you have the capacity to receive, learn about, and put into practice the precept which has just been read, or Denise, are you ready? Here is the list of the ten novice precepts on protecting life. Aware of the suffering brought about by the destruction of life, I vow to cultivate compassion and learn ways to protect the lives of people and all other species. I vow not to kill, not to let others kill, and not to condone any act of killing in the world by my way of thinking or by my way of life. This is the first of the ten novice precepts. Do you make the vow to receive, study, and practice it? Yes, I do. The earth. Touch the earth. Here is the set of the ten novice precepts on respecting what belongs to others. Aware of the suffering caused by exploitation, social injustice, stealing, and oppression, I vow to cultivate loving kindness in order to bring joy and peace to people and all other species. I am determined to share my time and energy with those who are in need. I vow not to steal. And not to possess anything which should belong to my community or to anyone else. I shall respect the property of others, but I shall also prevent others from making profit from human suffering or the suffering of other species.
This is the second of the ten novice precepts. Do you make the vow to receive, study and practice it? Here is the third of the ten novice precepts on protecting chastity. Aware that the aspiration of a monk or a nun can only be realized when I wholly leave behind the bondage of sexual desire, I vow to protect myself by the practice of chastity and to do all that I can to help others to protect themselves. I know that any sexual engagement will destroy my life as a monk or a nun will damage the lives of others and will also prevent me from realizing my ideal of serving all beings. This is the third of the ten novice precepts. Do you make the vow to receive, study and practice it? Here is the fourth of the ten novice precepts on mindful speech and deep listening. Aware of the suffering caused by unmindful speech, I vow to cultivate right speech and deep listening in order to bring joy and happiness to others and relieve others of their suffering. Knowing that words can create happiness or suffering, I am determined to say only things which can inspire self-confidence, peace, joy and hope. I am determined to speak the truth in a way that brings about harmony and reconciliation. I vow not to say things which are untrue or which bring about division and hatred. I vow not to spread news which I do not know to be certain and not to criticize and condemn things of which I am not sure. I am determined to listen deeply with love and compassion in order to be able to understand the suffering and the difficulties of others and to relieve their pain. I am determined not to say things which can bring about disharmony in my community of practice or which can bring about division and cause the community to break. I am determined not to talk about the faults of any monk or nun outside my Sangha or of another practice center, even though I may think that these faults are real. This is the fourth of the ten novice precepts. Do you make the vow to receive, study and practice it? Yes. Here is the fifth of the ten novice precepts on protecting and nourishing body and mind, not using alcohol, drugs or products that contain toxins. Aware of the suffering caused by the consumption of alcohol, drugs and other intoxicants, I vow not to ingest foods and beverages which contain toxins and which deprive me of the control of my body and mind or bring about heaviness and ill-being in my body or my spirit. I am determined to practice mindfulness of eating, drinking and consuming. I am determined to consume only things which can bring peace and joy to my body and mind. I vow not to consume alcohol, not to use drugs, 
and not to consume anything that contains toxins, including books, magazines, and films, which can poison me with violence, fear, craving, and hatred. This is the fifth of the ten novice precepts. Do you make the vow to receive, study, and practice it? Here is the sixth of the ten novice precepts on not using cosmetics or wearing jewellery. Aware that the true beauty of a monk or a nun is found in their stability and freedom, I vow to adorn myself and my sangha every day with the practice of mindfulness made concrete by my training in the precepts and fine manners in daily life. I know that cosmetics and jewellery only bring about an outer show of attractiveness with the intention of fostering attachment and infatuation. Therefore, I vow to live simply and to dress neatly in clean garments. I am resolved not to use perfume, powder, and other cosmetics or jewelry. This is the sixth of the ten novice precepts. Do you make the vow to receive, study, and practice it? Here is the seventh of the ten novice precepts on not being caught in worldly amusements. Aware of the fact that many songs, films, books, amusements and games in the world can damage the body and mind of a monk or a nun and take away the time which could be used for my study and practice, I am determined not to allow myself to be drowned in these distractions. I am determined not to read novels, not to look at worldly films and books, and not to, not to seek distraction in singing or listening to love songs and other kinds of music which cause negative emotions, and also not to waste time in playing electronic games and gambling. This is the seventh of the ten novice precepts. Do you make the vow to receive, study, and practice it? Here is the eighth of the ten novice precepts on not living a life of material luxury. Aware of the fact that a monk or a nun who lives in conditions of too much comfort and luxury will be an easy prey to sensual, pride, sensual desire and pride, I vow for my whole life only to live simply with few desires. I am resolved not to sit or to lie on luxurious chairs and beds and not to use silks, embroideries, or luxurious living quarters and means of transport. This is the eighth of the ten novice precepts. Do you make the vow to receive, study, and practice it?
Here is the ninth of the ten novice precepts on being vegetarian and not eating apart from the Sangha. Aware of the need to maintain good health, to live in harmony with the Sangha, and to nourish compassion in my heart, I vow to be vegetarian for the whole of my life and not to eat apart from the Sangha, except when I am sick. This is the ninth of the ten novice precepts. Do you make the vow to receive, study, and practice it? Here is the tenth of the ten novice precepts on not accumulating money or possessions for personal use. Aware that the happiness of a monk or a nun is found in solidity and freedom, I vow not to allow money and possessions to become a preoccupation in my life. I am determined not to accumulate money and possessions for my own use and not to look for happiness in the accumulation of money and possessions or to think that money, precious objects, and possessions will guarantee my security. This is the tenth of the ten novice precepts. Do you make the vow to receive, study, and practice it? Novices, you have received the ten precious novice precepts and you have been accepted in the monastic community. To have been born a human, to have had the opportunity to encounter the Buddha, the Dharma, and to, to participate in the way of life of the community of monks and nuns is a great fortune for yourself, for your family, and for your ancestors. Time passes by very quickly. Be diligent in learning and practicing. Do not waste your time and your youth. When you hear the bell, please touch the earth three times before the three jewels to show your gratitude. Novices, please kneel down to receive the robe of the Buddha. Yeah, con kính mời sáu sư anh lên trao nguyện cho các sư em. Người thầy Nhân Tịnh, thầy Đồng Trí, thầy Pháp Tiến, thầy Pháp Khả, thầy cho đến thầy Pháp Thể. Con mời ba sư mẹ 
Trời cho các sàn Phát biểu Mới phải phát biểu It's a happy moment Mời các uh, sư mẹ, các sư anh uh, nâng y uh, đứng một bên Các uh, sư em mới uh, Sau khi các sư em đọc xong bài kể thì trao y cho các em Mời các sư anh chị thì cầm, uh, cầm y, các em chắp tay Ordinance this joint upon Please repeat after me. How wondrous is the robe of freedom. It is the field of all good seeds. I bow my head to receive it today and to express my profound gratitude. the earth three times to show your gratitude to the three jewels. sit down. Uh, you, you can sit. <coughs> yeah. That's okay. Please, um, ordinees, please kneel um, to receive <laughs> to receive your ordination certificates. Certificate of Ordination. The great
great way of reality is our true nature's pure ocean. The source of mind penetrates everywhere. From the roots of virtue springs the practice of compassion. Precepts, concentration and insight, the nature and function of all three are one. The fruit of transcendent wisdom can be realized by being wonderfully together. Maintain and transmit the wonderful principle in order to reveal the true teaching. For the realization of true emptiness to be possible, wisdom and action must go together. This is to certify that Rosa Maria Martinez Santiala has been ordained as a Sharmanerica. She belongs to the 43rd generation of the Lin Chi Dhyana school and the ninth generation of the Liu Kuang Dharma line. Lineage name, pure emptiness of the heart. Dharma name, Chan Trang Hu Tuan, a true moon of filial harmony. Chan Trang Hu Tuan. The ordination was conducted on the third day of October in the year 2020 in Plum Village Practice Center, France, by Diana Master Trangquang Nyathan of the 42nd generation of the Lin Chi Diana School and the eighth generation of the Liu Quang Dharma line. <laughs> This is to certify that Andrea Zanelli has been ordained as a Shramanera. He belongs to the 43rd generation of the Lin Chi Dhyana school and the ninth generation of the Liu Kuang Dharma line. Lineage name, liberating path of the heart. Dharma name. Chân, chân trời niềm xa. Chân trời niềm xa. <laughs> True sky of mindful equanimity. Mời thầy Nguyễn Tân trao kế đã trao điệp cho em. What is that in Italian? Yeah. This is to certify that Thomas Gerard Patrick Glennon has been ordained as a Shramanera. He belongs to the 43rd generation of the Lin Chi Dhyana school and the ninth generation of the Liu Quang Dharma line. Lineage name, peaceful arrival of the heart. Dharma name, Chân trời niềm hoa. True sky of mindful harmony. Mời thầy đồng trí trao điệp cho em. This is to certify that Katrien, Katrien uh, van der Berge, roughly, okay, has been ordained as a Shramanerica. She belongs to the 43rd generation of the Lin Chi Dhyana school and the ninth generation of the Liu Quang Dharma line. Lineage name, joyful listening of the heart. Dharma name, Chân Trang Hiếu Khai. True moon of filial openness. Suko. Khai này có nghĩa là mở, khai mở, 
openness nhưng mà cũng có nghĩa là một cái gì đó mới bắt đầu như hoa khai kiến phật hoa nở thấy buồn This is to certify that Aurelian Jacques Thierry Gerard de Lau has been ordained as a Shramanera. He belongs to the 43rd generation of the Lin Chi Dhyana school and the ninth generation of the Yukang Dharma line. Lineage name Compréhension Naturelle du Coeur. Dharma name Chân Trời Niềm Lưu. True sky of flowing mindfulness. Mời thầy pháp tiếng cao điệp cho xem. This is to certify that Chevu has been ordained as a Shramanera. He belongs to the 43rd generation of the Lin Chi Dhyana school and the ninth generation of the Liu Quang Dharma line. Lineage name, gentle acceptance of the heart. Dharma name. Chân trời niềm khiêm. True sky of mindful humility. Kính mời Thầy Phật uh, lên cao kề trong điệp cho xem. This is to certify that Julio Alejandro Amas España has been ordained as a Shramanera. He belongs to the 43rd generation of the Lin Chi Dhyana school and the ninth generation of the Liu Quang Dharma line. Lineage name, peaceful home of the heart. Dharma name, Chân trời niềm thuần. True sky of clear mindfulness. Mời thầy, thầy học khá. Sư cô Thuần Khánh đã chuẩn bị quà cho xem. Thuần. Yeah. This is to certify that Ian Campbell Wiseman has been ordained as a Shramanera. He belongs to the 43rd generation of the Lin Chi Dhyana school and the ninth generation of the Liu Quang Dharma line. Lineage name, kind awakening of the heart. Dharma name, Chân trời niềm tấn. 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 True sky of mindful diligence. Kính mời thầy phát biểu đã điệp cho sư em. Đây là sư Úc, sư Chai. This is to certify that Shi Chai has been ordained as a Shramanerika. She belongs to the 43rd generation of the Lin Chi Dhyana school and the ninth generation of the Liu Quang Dharma line. Lineage name, Smiling Moon of the Heart. Chân Trăng Hiệu Đức. That's her Dharma name. <laughs> And in English, True Moon of Filial Virtue. Sư Úc là tên là Chân Trăng Hiệu Đức. Dạ, có mời sư mẹ tùy nghiêm.
Dạ, con mời đại chúng chấp tay hồi hướng. Transmitting the precepts, practicing the way of awareness, gives rise to benefits without limit. We So dear Thai, dear Sangha, so first of all, we'd like to congratulate our new novice brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Brown family. <laughs> uh, so the next ceremony will be... Um, <laughs> and we will, would like to invite all the novices to kneel down again to enjoy your hair being saved by our elder brothers and sisters at the end uh, near by the entrance of this meditation hall and we are all requested to stand beyond the line that has been marked so that uh, the brothers and sister can um, shave the hair peacefully and joyfully together and after that our new novice brothers and sister will change and then meet our elder brothers and sisters at thai's heart and drink tea together and after that, the Sangha will have picnic lunch at 12.30. And then at 3 o'clock, they will be be in to welcome our new brothers and sister in this big meditation hall. And for the family that is online, we would like to congratulate you also. And uh, we are very pleased to have uh, a new brothers and sister in our family and you are also part of our family and you are all invited also to come and join the be in at three o'clock uh, in france uh, france time uh, with the same link that you have this morning so thank you very much dear sangha <laughs> 